Yo, what's going on YouTube? My name is, of course, Catman Joe, and welcome back, everybody, to another brand new video, guys. Today, of course, we are back on some Minecraft, guys, and today, we're going to be going over another NPC Village tutorial, folks. Today, we're going to be going after, I believe, the Medium House number three. Now, exactly, I was correct. The Tiger House Medium House number three. I love the actual name. It's actually pretty boss. Um, but, yeah, guys, so today, we're going to be doing another NPC Village tutorial, folks, and, of course, this is obviously us nearing the end of our little series. I mentioned that a couple episodes ago, but uh, this one right here, guys, is a decent little house. You guys can see it right there. It's a pretty big house, and one that's probably quite commonly seen as well in many worlds or I guess many different villages so uh yeah let's get right to it guys so to begin with the shopping list will be as always down below in the actual I guess uh, description as always but it's also of course going to be in the screen right now if you guys want to get it it's of course as I do in the description it's much easier to get it there but nonetheless let's jump into it so you're going to need a you're sorry uh, you're, I'm already messing up you're going to need a stack and 33 spruce logs one stack and 24 cobblestone 30 oak planks or oak, where, where, where did I get oak from 30 spruce planks sorry Right, two spruce wood stairs, four glass panes, along with that, of course, two spruce doors, one or one, five torches, sorry, one chest, 11 spruce trap doors, 11, or again, you want to take a second, George, you want to just, that's 11, that's, th th this is free. Can you see the difference? 11 and three. A, a 3 and 11, a 3 and 11, not, not an 11 and 3, it doesn't matter, anyway, you guys know what I'm saying right here, 4 bookshelves, 1 crafting table, and 2 blue beds, and that is everything you need to build this house, guys, so, without further ado, I said, anyway, let's just jump right into it, so, for, I guess, us to begin, I guess we should probably begin on the left side, the left side feels like this is a good area to begin, so, you're going to want to begin by building one of the main doorways, this entire length is built, by the way, is what, 3, 6, 9, it's 9 blocks wide, obviously, or in length, obviously, all the way across, and, uh, and of course, the width, it's like about five blocks at a max push so we're going to want to go here right now we're going to want to go one two like this uh we're going to want to come back and do another three on the top i guess basically making a t-junction this is for the floor plan by the way of the house this is simply put just for the floor so nothing else nothing more nothing less so yeah be aware then what we're going to want to do is of course fill this on like this making a three by three with obviously a two part in the front do the exact same thing over here and we'll connect up in the middle and you guys can obviously yeah, i guess mirror it. obviously it's not very hard right here in the middle you're going to want to put a two by three so one two three one two three like that and then basically of course do the exact same you've done the side like that so this is what you should end up with obviously of course you should be able to i guess put it in half and it should be exactly symmetrical like that i'm sure all you guys can copy and follow along it's not too difficult honestly to do so uh, also of course as well if you don't know of course it goes without saying i feel like but obviously a pickaxe and an, uh, I, I guess uh, an axe in general it's obviously going to save your life it's going to be quite useful guys so yeah anyway let's build the two main walls so we're going to want to go like this one two three we're going to want to go one two three uh, in fact we can actually go as well for what am i doing here i'm building what am i dude i'm looking at this like wait what did i just do wrong there it doesn't look right does it what, what am i doing the ss so remember guys we're only building the white parts not the actual yellow parts here those are the parts that we don't build on so yeah we're gonna want to go obviously on the very far left hand side again obviously like this guys we're gonna want to come one block up from here like this and go one two three four like so so it looks just like that guys all right from here as well we're gonna want to bring this up by two blocks so one two all the way across one two one two one two one two in the top like this as well so basically what you should have is obviously three blocks tall on both sides here four blocks in the middle of course like this and then three on the other side like so and do the exact same thing on the other side of the building as well it's honestly a lot easier or a lot more easier to obviously what am i doing i'm doing it again man i'm doing it again i'm already messing up and um, obviously of course folks i think it goes without saying it's a lot more easier to obviously of course work with the design like this obviously by putting in the wall first and then interior last i oftentimes forget to really follow that i guess kind of little tip right there but it really does help a hell of a lot guys so yeah uh, anyway from here we're going to want to start doing the back wall so you can just really quickly and really easily just connect it all up all the way across the back like this we're also going to want to start putting in our windows so we're going to want to put in one block in each side like this so we're going to want to go one block and then obviously we'll get our windows so one window we're going to want to do one two then one window and then one two or i think well, let me let me just try here so one we're going to want to put one window then we're going to want to go one two and then there'll be one window here like so like that guys so you have three windows in the back like this this is exactly right in fact i'm just i'm just double checking going did i do that correct i'm pretty sure i did i'm, I'm pretty sure it's almost correct but yeah that's exactly how it's maybe like that guys so from there as well you can also use your cobblestone once again bring that all the way across the entire roof like this right here having a fully connected wall also adding your spruce trap doors all the way from the up going down like that up going down up going down up going down up going down and up going down guys so you should only have five spruce trap doors left and then I mean, that's pretty much us almost done with the back. I mean, that, that is pretty much us done with the back. It's more or less just a roof now that we need working on in the future. But uh, we'll get to that, guys. So, 
from here, we're obviously going to start doing the entrance points of the bone. You guys can see right here, of course, this is how it looks. It looks pretty goody. Pretty, pretty goody. Pre pretty Gucci. That's what I'm trying to say right there, guys. It looks pretty Gucci. We're going to want to make these parts here, obviously, right beside the original two parts here, like this. Again, these blocks here and here. Uh, like, I'll do it on both sides, actually, actually, so you guys can get, I guess, a bit of an understanding because it's hard to explain. What you're going to want to do is something like this. And then you're going to want to add an additional two blocks onto each one of these. So like this, we'll go one, two. In fact, do we need to add one, two? We'll, we'll try it like this. So we'll do one, two. And then I know for a fact it's three blocks here like this. And I'm pretty sure it's, yeah, it's one, two. So once you've got one, go one, two, making all three blocks tall. And then go like this, one, two, one, two. Put one in the middle here because it's the obviously doorway kind of frame. And uh, you guys can see, I mean, it's already coming together quite rapidly. So from here as well, we're going to want to place another three blocks. So one, two, three. Obviously make it like a three by three, of course, leaving one gap in the middle for a window. I think it goes without saying. I think it was something you all could probably expect. I was going to do, obviously, you probably just seen the previous bone one. That's obviously what he's going to do. So uh, yeah, it's it's not too hard to follow along, guys. You guys can see right here. I mean, it's uh, it's pretty simple. It's pretty straightforward. And it's pretty, I guess, self-explanatory if you like. Anyway, though, let's continue from here. So once we go this, we can also add, uh, add in our actual doorway kind of torches like so we can also use also come to speak about doorways our doors as well because we want to try and get as ready i guess or get rid of as many resources that we have as possible or as fast as possible so i'm going to make it like this so the doors are identical to that so yeah both doors kind of point like this inwards with the handles so they both open up in the way to the right and left hand side properly we're going to want to come on the inside as well you guys can see it looks um it looks pretty good it looks pretty good uh, i wonder if we should add the interior a little bit now because we do need to do the roof but we can do the interior and the roof so i'm pretty sure I'll have to go double check, but I'm pretty sure both beds go like this in the corners. Uh, let me just try and run past here real quick. I shall go double check that. Both beds in the corners, both right and left. Obviously, we're going to have the chest down there. Craft the bench here. Okay, okay, so we're pretty good. All right, I'm just double checking, guys. Just double checking. So, on the right hand side of the room, first, you're going to want to place a bed like this. At the very bottom of that bed, you're going to want to place a crafting bench like here. So, it's like that. And then do the exact same on the other side about it, except for my crafting bench, you're going to want to place a chest. Now, you can place a chest any direction. I believe it's actually going to be like this. I know it looks kind of weird, but that's actually the design it's meant to be. Again, I'm not too sure, though, because even at that, I'm looking at it going, hmm, it doesn't look that great, but nonetheless. Uh, we're also going to build like a little bit of a table here, like so. We're going to build another table here as well, like this. It looks kind of weird. I'm, I honestly, the more I look at this, more I'm like, that doesn't really look right. But I mean, it is 100%. I'm pretty sure. So we're gonna run back in. Just gonna go double check. Yep, we got there. We got this. I was actually right beside the bed there, in fact. And we're gonna have one in the middle, like so. Yep. And then we're gonna have the bookshelves above there. And that's pretty much us. It looks actually really good, honestly. I'm not gonna lie. That actually looks really, really, really good. So my apologies. We'll move this one right across here by one, uh, making both obviously, of course, these little side, I guess, tables. Uh, I guess symmetrical. And then in the middle, add another side table along with two chairs. And I'm pretty sure the chairs went not like that. They, I'm pretty sure the chairs are a bit closer than that. They were like that. I believe like that. I think I think that's how they were. I, again, just try and bite with me, guys. I know it's not. I'm not like the easiest guy to follow when it comes to doing a tutorial, but it does work. Obviously, I mean, you get the gist of it. Obviously, of course, and that's pretty much all that matters. Now, uh, from here, obviously, folks, we're pretty much at the end of the entire stage of building this house, aside from the roof. Obviously, the roof is going to be one of the main key kind of points to this entire build that uh, obviously we're going to have to kind of focus on a little bit right now. So, with the roof itself, you're not going to want to begin by doing any of the kind of small minuscule details. You want to do the, I guess, the top main pillar first. So, what we're going to want to do is like. Like this pretty much make it too wide like so on the very top main pillar and then drag that across by two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve 13 so it should be 13 blocks long we're gonna use our last bit of cobblestone here as well because somehow i must have missed that uh 13 blocks long like so again do it once more making the entire top runner i guess or top uh, i guess roof kind of i guess chunk if you want to call that i don't know i don't really know what i'm going to call this thing here but the entire i guess roof kind of part all obviously one big straight line like so now it looks kind of ugly i know again by you know bear with me guys bear with me uh from here as well we're gonna want to put one here uh, like this one two three and then one two three i guess like little pillars as well again here one two three and then one, two, three, like that. We're gonna start building like little pyramids as well. So you can probably just copy this three wide kind of design above it. So like this, like this, like, oh, geez. Uh, we can keep doing the exact same thing. It's actually quite good with these builds because they are quite a lot of rinse and repeat. A lot of the builds you'll see with the NPC villages is uh, they're pretty much, uh, well, not they are pretty much, they pretty much are in general uh, quite symmetrical. And I just placed that in the wrong place. So yeah, let me just, let me just real quick. I, we, I didn't do that, all right? I didn't, yeah, listen, I didn't do that, all right? You, you guys didn't see anything, all right? 
I feel like somebody's commenting already like, hey, yo, man, like this may be like a survival creative tutorial. What was that, man? That was terrible. Come on, Joe. This, 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 oh, man, just disgusting. Anywho, so once you've done the entire roof part like this, we're also going to want to drag this all the way across here as well. Basically adding the entire roof panel in. And you can see now it is really starting to take shape, of course. It's starting to actually look really nice and really Gucci. So I'm quite happy the actual result of this so far. And uh, we can also add a massive main pillar here as well. So we can actually do that right now as well if we want. Based on another pillar like this uh, and actually dragging it all the way through. Don't go cheap, guys. This this bowl is a little bit more expensive to work with, obviously, because some of the materials and whatnot, you know, spruce wood and everything else. But it's well worth it. If you're really willing to put in the work, it'll be well worth it at the end of the day, guys. So, yeah. Anywho, this is how it should look like this, obviously, on the side or on the front, obviously, right now. I think that looks pretty fantastic. I think it looks pretty good. Uh, obviously, of course, you know, there's some things that you can change for yourself, of course. But for now, I think that works pretty well. Anyway, so you guys will probably know so well. We've only got, you know, obviously 26 more logs, which means the, I guess, remaining, obviously, 26 logs are going to have to go into the roof as well. So let's just quickly just pull that all the way across like so. And then we'll be able to add the final few details and that'll be the entire build, obviously, done, guys. So, yeah, hope you did go to enjoy this tutorial. I mean, I really do enjoy doing these, tut uh, these tutorials, guys, because honestly, it's kind of like a little, like a bit of a nice kind of healthy, I guess, breakup from the normal kind of videos because it's just something that's just like whew, all right you relax sit back you know what i mean make a video just build have some fun you know and just enjoy minecraft the way it's supposed to be you know what i mean and uh something that's it just it's nice it's like it's just it's just relaxing you know what i mean uh, anyway so from here of course we can also you know of course fix this we're going to want to go like this we're going to want to place one block above here and then one block in like that and then do exactly the same another side like this one block in here one block like that and that should be your entire build of course of all the bookshelves all the tables all the beds crafting benches chests everything like that torches whatever all in the right places all fantastic all gorgeous and uh, that should be medium house number three completely done guys so yeah anyway folks hope you guys did go to enjoy today's tutorial if you guys did as always please be sure to drop a like on it of course and of course if you're new as well please be sure to subscribe we are currently marching away right now guys to 30,000 subscribers and every new subscriber does help on that kind of like little journey to that i guess destination in the road if you want to call it that my voice is starting to go kind of a bit weird you can probably tell it's starting to kind of lose itself so my apologies but uh, yeah folks i'm not thank you for watching today's video i'll see you guys on the next one have a wonderful day or a wonderful night wherever you guys are and you guys peace out